A very merry boxing to you. A boxing is a thing that makes balls do so true. A very merry boxing, a very merry boxing, a very merry boxing to all. Hey everybody, and welcome to a, another installment of A Very Merry Unboxing. Today, we actually have something I've been waiting for for a while now. This is the first box for the Marvel Collector Core, um, powered by Funko. And I like this box. It's a nice sturdy box. It's got... Uh, this one has Captain America on the front of it. This is Marvel Collector Core on the side. <clears throat> and on the front, Avengers. it says Avengers. So I'm wondering if we'll like, we like have them different things every time, like one of them will be like, a, like Avengers, like this one, it is then possible. Like Guardians of the Galaxy, Spider Man. We don't know. We'll see. I imagine they're going to theme each one of them. Now, everything in these boxes is supposed to be exclusive to these boxes. So that's kind of a cool thing about this. Um, I will leave uh, a link in the description below if you would like to try to order yourself one of these and uh, see what they're all about. So well, the good thing is there's, oh, I was about to say there's no tape, but there is tape. Yeah, just a little bit on the side here. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. And- We uh, just opened it from the top. Sure, no. Show everyone what is inside here. Whoa! Check Whoa. it out. So the first thing you guys will notice is that on the inside, I'll tell you in a second. On the inside, you've got some comic strip on the box, comic strip strip art. Really quick, I'm gonna go for a guess. This is all chalk. Yes, and right on the top when we open this, the first thing is an Ultron patch to um, iron on or sew on to like a, a piece Wrong. of, uh, an article theme. of clothing. So, Collector theme. Core Ultron. And then you have a button, ooh, a Marvel Collector Core button. It is Captain America on the front of it. It says Collector Core. So both of these things are ways to tell people, hey, I am a member of the Collector Core. Yeah. We also, I don't know if they're still doing it or not, but uh, we signed up for the, the year membership. Um, and there were six of them. And they also give you, like if you renew yearly without letting it expire, you get, um, it's a founder's statue. So every year at the annual anniversary of it, if I roll it over, you get a, a, a statue that comes with it. So now that that awesome. happens, the uh, so the maybe, cool thing. Maybe also they'll just have like a load of comics that is maybe. like at the end to be continued. That maybe. Comes by so now. now you have a little uh, hatch on the on the inside that opens up this way. So that's kind of cool because look, you've got both ends. So it protects the stuff inside with this inner lid. I got so <clears throat> let's go ahead and take a look Ooh, and see the first. The thing that is evident on here is something that is exclusive. Like I said, everything in here is exclusive to the uh, Collector Core, but it is the Age of Ultron Hulk Buster. So look at this thing. Hang on, Jenner. So let's take a look at this thing first. And you've got, look at that. I'll take him out because of the glare. He is pretty heavy. Um, some nice art on the back, or on the side rather. There's Hulkbuster on this end. And you cannot get this in stores. This is apparently exclusive to this collector core. So if you want to complete your Age of Ultron set, you needed to get this out of the collector core box. Box. Yeah. Oh, oh, this! And it's not even as heavy as, like, Baymax. So, now, I'm going to go ahead and open this up. I'm going to be very careful with opening this. And then we will let uh, Joshua bring it over and show you guys. And then we'll get into the next thing that Tanner will uh, bring over and show you. I don't, I don't ever want to sell this, Dad. No, we're, <laughs> we're not going to sell this. This is... 
And why are you carefully taking it out? Because it's worth more if the box and everything is intact. But we're never going to sell it. In the future, years from now, if it's worth $2,000, which I seriously doubt, but that would be something that we would do. So, oh, well, wow. it is an exclusive, so someone might really I, I be willing really to trade it out last night. No, you won't. Wow. wow, this is, it actually does have weight. It is incredibly detailed. Um, just, oh, wow, the, the, the work that they did on this has a, a lot of little fine lines in it. Uh, just the, the way his armor is built. Wow, it is, they took, a, they took a lot of time and effort on this mold. This is a really good looking figure. Joshua, you want to take it up there and show everybody the way it looks? And then I'm really, so, so this is the Hulkbuster. Wow, He's look at that. He's a bobblehead. Yeah, He's all the marbles are bobbleheads. Vinyl, vinyl? Yes. He's a vinyl bobblehead. Look at that. On the side. Look at what they did. They like sculpted this just right. Mm hmm Look at the back. The back. Look at the look at the detail work on the back of it. Wow. That is really cool. So So I can't take this from the back. No. We're gonna put this back in the box and while I am doing that, Tanner has this next piece. It is a this is a new thing that they're going to start doing. They're called dorbs. It's a new kind of... I thought of, it was derbs. No, nope, because... dorbs. It's a new kind of vinyl toy that they are going to be doing. So what, Tanner's... What I'm hoping for is a... What are you looking at, Tanner? A Groot. I want a little Groot. That Can would I be see cool. It? I'm already opening it. So Tanner's going to open that one and we'll see what is in there. Now, this is exclusive to Wait, this. Wait, it has Ultron on the front, so maybe it's an exclusive Ultron. Maybe. We will see as soon as he gets that open. It's on the box. Let me see. It doesn't actually have Ultron on it, except for mm. the front. Oh, it is Ultron! So, check him out. I thought it was this one. Oh, how cool. These are, <laughs> they're just, their head moves. Look at, their head moves around. They're, uh, <laughs> they're just little teeny, they remind me of nesting eggs. Um, but that's all it is. Look at that. It's, it's cute. It's very cute. Um, I don't know how many of these we'd go for and get, but... It is, it is very, very cute. And he's a little smiling Ultron. Look at that. I think that that That's one. pretty cool. So... Can I see it? Yeah, take a look at that one. They've got a lot of different ones. I'm not sure if Tanner did show you or not, but um, lots of different kinds that you can get right there. And they're going to have some that are like Hot Topic exclusives and stuff. Um, <clears throat> but so yeah. These actually are coming soon. Mm -hmm. So, so this one was just but, like this. Well, no. This one. particular one is exclusive, I think, to this Collector Core box. You can't get this, again, you cannot get this Ultron one anywhere else except for this Collector Core box. So, now we've got ooh, a t shirt. We will go ahead and take a look and see what this shirt is it looks pretty cool it iron is man. look at it is iron man versus ultron oh look at that that is pretty cool right there so we've got live at the infinite avengers mansion watch the heroic high flying avengers on home now or no home tv Presented by Marvel, No Strings Match, Iron Man vs. Ultron, May 2015, Thrills Action Explosion, Marvel Collector Core. That is awesome. So, we are going to go ahead and 
do some, uh, let me get this off of here. We're gonna do some video magic and get myself in this shirt. So, one, two, three. All right, look at that. Very cool. And here's so, the now we've got the shirt. Let's get this no, pin back on. Tanner will put it back on me. Be careful I'm, that you don't stab that. Here, we'll put it way up here. No, okay, I'm no. putting it in the A. I'm putting it in the A. And then while he's doing that, the last thing in this box Whoa, it's a is a variant edition Guardians Team Up Avengers. And this, again, this is a variant edition exclusive to this Marvel Collect Core box. So that's pretty cool right there. So that was that was what we had in this one. I am very pleased. On the back it says A Force. Well, there's another book, an A Force book. So I'm very pleased with this box. I like the way it came out. Uh, I'm happy because I ordered the year. I had uh, subscribed for the year and hopefully, like I said, I'll keep rolling it over and get those founder statues. Yeah. But it's a great thing because now I know, looking at this, if the next future boxes are the same caliber, I'm going to love them. I'm going to love every one of them. I think there's supposed to be a pop in each one. I think uh, there's supposed to be um, another collectible in each one and we'll see how it goes. So. Let us know what you think uh, about this particular box. Do you guys give it a thumbs up, uh, thumbs down, leave some comments down below. And uh, Avengers Age of Ultron coming up May 1st. Some parts of the world have it already. So if you leave comments on things, no spoilers, please. We want to be aware and, and, and keep on uh, being surprised when it comes out. We've kind of been avoiding some of the, the videos that are out there so that we are surprised. If you like this, please give us a thumbs up and share this video with your friends um, through Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus, however you share them. And be sure to subscribe right over this little one's face. And we will catch you next time on the next installment of A Very Merry Unboxing. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye. Have a great one.